So I'm going to finish going peanut here. Pack out the grocery and the grocery haul. Clean the fridge. And record myself or pack it up and thing. I'm going to eat it. I can't bother that. Mm -mm. Me? Can't bother. beautiful people and welcome back to my youtube channel i know it seemed like i wasn't going to do this video based on how it started but here we are so i'm just going to show you my little grocery haul all the stuff that i got from my place progressive supermarket you know that's where this household shops right i apologize if the lighting is off but i really hope that you can see all of what's going on here if it's your first time here please ensure you check out all my other supermarket hauls and all my other shop with me's and just all my other videos ensure you like this video leave a nice comment share and tell your friends and subscribe so before i start packing this stuff away i'm just going to show you all the things that i got and you can leave a comment down below how much you think i spent all right so i'm just gonna put stuff in the fridge and put stuff in our little makeshift pantry yeah around the back behind the dining table don't come for me it's all like a makeshift punch and we have to make do with what we got. Right? So, let's just dive right in. Stuff in the fridge very quickly. So, I'm just going to put away the other stuff. Right? And you can see. So, this detergent, a real detergent, again, only detergent this household really uses it has to not be a progressive or not be at Mega Mart for us to use something else and the Fabuloso and the toothpaste they were having some kind of special in this supermarket I don't really know what but you know what I mean this olive oil hair lotion hair and scalp lotion I got for my daughter I'm just gonna put these away. Very good. So I have some snacks. These were already here. Um, these are the ones I bought. Just these, really, because of course, as you can see, we already have quite a few. Especially cheesies. Cheesies is her favorite. <laughs>
everything in the fridge now except the cornbread of course the oats and the black pepper but the fridge needs a bit of cleaning out first the freezer and the fridge so wish me luck <laughs> bottle that has half water half vinegar and just wipe off the shelves and repack you understand me and if there's any garbage in here I'm going to just get rid of it I could have done the approach where I take everything out, but I ain't doing that. <laughs> this thing, this thing that I'm sliding across here, is um for the draw, like where you put um deli meat and those kind of things. But guess what? I don't have that much kind of deli meat, so I'm not gonna make it take up space right here. So yeah, that's all right. So how about no? Mm -hmm. So, you know how long girl want the one fridge organizing video? But guess what? I'm not spending my money buying all those organizers because I cannot maintain such a expensive fridge, which means constantly having it filled <laughs> your girl can't maintain that you know like how they have that little container where them putting in um them fruits and them veg and them oh my god it looks so aesthetically pleasing but your girl <laughs> don't have any money for that so i'm just, I'm just making do with what I got this aloe drink has been in this fridge for forever it says it expires October so I need to probably drink it before something go wrong right already had a, a bottle of milk and this one's almost done and apple juice for mixed peanut yeah the cool so I can have one with my dinner later and mommy can have one with her dinner later okay. second chef all in food here that's the go not the cake though <laughs> definitely not the cake boo not the cake
we have this little um deodorizer in the fridge it says change every 30 days i think 30 days has passed so i'm gonna change it <laughs> here we go i'm gonna get rid of this one one of these to stick it on the fridge is already in the fridge but because we're just completely out with the old in i'm just gonna remove it and just apply the entire new thing let me just wipe the area yeah boom in the fridge right there Throw this one away. And I do rinse out the rag. So, don't come for me. All right, your girl ain't no organizer. <laughs> but, I don't remember where I got this little thing from. But we're gonna put it right there. Putting peanut juice. So all of these things, I'm trying to put them this low. I already had one of these. I'm trying to put them this low so that if the fridge door opens, because she can't open the fridge door, but if the fridge door opens, she has access to this and she she loves juice. I wonder if I should put it in the middle. Put it over this side. Middle. This side. This side. Leave a comment below because I can always move it. So leave a comment below where you think I should keep it. My cake is going back in the fridge right there. And the eggs go right there. So tell me if I should swap places with the eggs and the juice or put the juice in the middle. And if you get my thing? So I like it that way, but let's let that take for the aesthetics. So you know my yogurts go outside. I don't have any other container you understand because we're not we don't know if we can maintain the yogurt like so we're not way you understand me um this is some then up from my partner oh something and thing again all of these bag juice it's my partner's actually um and these are chocolate chocolate Whenever I get um whenever I get a nice um storage set, like if I come up with the idea to get a storage set, I will um create a whole Amazon storefront and hook you guys up. Food container. <laughs> but I put the cows in there. The cows not is a bag juice that's normally in the freezer. For all those who don't know. But my partner likes to have it as juice. So that's why it's not in the freezer, right? These two things go back in the fridge because they're good leftovers. Right? They're not spoiled. 
They're good leftovers. Anyways, my least favorite part of the fridge. But yeah. <laughs> You know those fancy videos where they wash the fruit with the they um are no fancy videos but just those videos where them wash the fruits with the vinegar or whatever and then them wash them veg with this and whatever i'm gonna get there you know i'm gonna get there but for this video um it is what it is <laughs> whenever um I'm getting there though. Whenever I'm getting there, I will definitely, most definitely, record for you guys. Because why not? Yeah, understand me? So, string in. Yeah, bitch. Ginger. Lettuce, lettuce, ginger. This container has in like season that we cut up already and like start use scotch bonnet <laughs> skeleton the time dry out so you know I have to show that I don't know what this is clearly it needs to go and that's it that is it for the draw and these Welsh snacks. You know, love Welsh snacks. You understand me?
This can throw away. From some pizza thing. I, for one, think we have way too many condiments in here. But if that's not it, you know, it's just that uh, too much condiment require refrigeration. I think that's it. So we don't have too much condiments. Let me carry on. We just have too much condiments that require refrigeration. But I think my fridge is getting tired of me, and I don't want to close. Yeah. But eventually, <laughs> eventually, <laughs> these are the things that happen when you clean your fridge. You can feel some, not all of the things, but some of the things them time. Like, why are you doing that? Like, why are you doing that? Ranch. Those are done. Tartar sauce. Tartar sauce like this, but it's when it's almost finishing, turn it upside. Thank me later. Parmesan cheese. I don't know why I will have two. Let me help out myself here. Let me help out myself here. Good. So that bin. And now we only have one. That's so good. <laughs> pickles. If you don't like pickles, we can't be friends. I said what I said, and that's it. Minced garlic, it was extremely expensive in the supermarket. But trust me, get it. It's a game changer. And rosin sauce, game changer. You understand me? Now, Margarine. I will have a little pack of open cornmeal. We're gonna just put that up back in the fridge with the margarine. I had an elastic on my hand. How convenient, right? Mm -hmm. I use the garlic pin to catch the fridge. Understand me? Not for me. Remember, I tell you, I am washing out the rag as I go. Right? And again, if you are still watching, I truly appreciate you because I know that this video quality might not be the best. But if you are still watching, I appreciate you. Please ensure you leave a comment below. Remember, you're guessing how much money I spent at the supermarket. And, yep, tell me if you like pickles. You understand me? And as soon as I get some more, some different storage containers and things, you know your girl got you with another video. So this is honey. I'm trying to determine if it's good or not. I don't I never wanted to leave it out because ants galore. But we're gonna see. We have two lime juice. I cannot pour one into the other because they're both decently filled. Some jelly. I think this is a sweet condiment section. Cinnamon to spread. Some cherries, baking powder, and this is some sweets. Got the butter and some cream cheese. Yeah. 
flower because we don't want no weevil. You understand me? Yeah. And then the last thing you know is jump here. I don't think this is one. It's not open, but I was about to say I don't think it's good, but clearly it probably is. So there you have it. I clean and organize the fridge, right? I have all these things to go and wash up now because that was the food in the fridge. Also going to give the fridge a nice little wipe down with um, this spray. It's the New Day Mango and Hibiscus All Purpose Lysol Cleaner. I'm just going to use it to wipe the entire front of the fridge. Just wiping it. This is a, as you can see, a old Duat brown rice container. I just repurpose it for my oats. Right, one already. I just make a nice scoop. Come on, Mr. Please, God. Come, Mr. Please. What is this? There it is. <laughs> Goes to show you that content creation is not always perfect, but they show you the perfection, right? I don't always have time for that. Voila! Like magic, it's done. Anyways, this can this is an old candle container. Let's use that for sugar. Again, repurposing at its best. Ladies, don't throw away those containers, those candle containers, wash them out and reuse. You understand? You could have even put a nice little label on here that says sugar. But again, remember, I'm gonna get there. And just like that, we're done. My head hot, literally. Hmm? Anyways, I'm gonna have my cup of soup now. I got some chicken and sweet corn soup. From Tizing Garden. Gonna just go and have that now and then finish comb my daughter's hair as I mentioned in the beginning of the video. Today's a Saturday. We're going to church tomorrow. So girl here have to come out. Do you understand me? So <laughs> I am so tired, but please ensure you like this video. 
leave a nice comment share and tell your friends and subscribe